So I'm calling out three companies in this video for what I've seen today, and today is not the first time and the only time that I've seen it. So I'm calling out KFC, number one, I'm calling out Deliveroo, number two, and I'm calling out Just Eats. Why? You'll find out. So welcome back, but if you're new to me, I'm a barrister who helps you understand law. So what am I calling out and why am I calling it out? Well, so we happen to be at KFC today and I noticed something that I've noticed a few times before. So this is not a one-off and I don't think it's right. The Deliveroo and the Just Eat drivers come into the KFC car park and they park in the disabled bays. They park there sometimes just to wait for the food to be ready for them to take off. And at least two or three occasions, because we stayed on the car park to eat, we saw them drive in, park up, stay there, and then drive away without actually taking any food from the KFC. Now, this is not only strange behaviour, because they're not taking the food from the KFC to take it off and deliver it, but worst still, you've obviously recognised the fact that they are parking in disabled spots. Now, it's possible that these drivers were disabled, but I don't think they were. And judging by the amount of drivers that came and went, I suspect that these drivers are simply using the disabled spots because it's easier than driving around the car park to look for somewhere to park so they can go in and pick up the food from the KFC. Now this is possibly happening at other restaurants as well, possibly not just KFC. So if you spot this, I would like you to raise it with the restaurant, preferably because that would be the most polite way to do it, because ultimately it's the restaurant's car park, it's private premises, and they should be maintaining and governing their car park rules in a fair and non-discriminatory way. Now, if the restaurant is allowing these delivery companies, in this case it was Deliveroo and Just Eat, if they are allowing these drivers to use the disabled spots to collect the food, then that's not what those disabled spots are designed for. They are obviously there to provide easier access for those who are disabled to get into the restaurant more easily. So if you happen to be the manager of one of these types of places and you're watching my videos, Please have some regard to the way that your delivery companies are using the car park facilities because if they are using the disabled spots and someone that comes in that needs them cannot access it, then you are not really catering to their needs. And so I would respectfully suggest that you look into the practices of these delivery companies coming in and parking. Not only are they using the disabled spots, but they are also coming in the exit, if you know what I mean, because there's a one-way system going on at this particular car park and these drivers drove into the exit and sort of forced the car in front of me and myself to sort of move out of the way because they forced their way into the exit, only then to go and drive in the disabled spot, which someone else would obviously not then be able to use. So I thought this was a very valid thing to raise. I hope that it falls on somebody's ears that can do something positive with this information. And in the meantime, I'd be really grateful if you like this video and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.